We all love a compulsory unboxing. Mm hmm. Hey guys, so I finally invested, which means we've got a funky new video coming up soon. Why you ask? Well, I'm kind of behind the times and I haven't had one of these before. And uh, I tested one of these out, as I said in my last vlog last time, and I managed to shoot the 77, which is five over par, which is my best round of 2018. And it's my best round in four years, uh, including an eagle and two birdies, which, Pretty sure I would never have got that close to the pin if I didn't know what the yardages exactly were. What's in the box? Comes in a nice little cover. Cheeky. Doesn't match my bag though. It's kind of tiny, actually. I'm surprised how big it is. In my hand, it fits really well and the design is pretty cool, a little bit plasticky, but hey, you'd expect that from the, uh, the lowest offering in the range. I'm impressed, I'm very impressed. And because I bought the Patriot version, or honestly, I, I don't really care what I was buying, I was just looking for the cheapest option in the range. They gave me this neoprene, I guess, cover, silicon cover to go with it which I can imagine will be quite handy here in Texas, how sweaty it gets on the golf course. So uh, a little bit of protection won't be bad. So this and this, it'll match my, my gear a little bit better as I'm all blue. So what I'm gonna do is with actually now I've got this piece of equipment is I'm gonna take it out on the golf course and I'm gonna test. I think I'm gonna do a five hole playthrough which has been requested by a few of the viewers and a few of the followers on Instagram to actually give you a more of a playthrough rather than just some footage of me playing, which I think is okay for now, but I think it gets boring after a while if you keep seeing the same stuff. So I'm gonna try and do you a four hole playthrough. And what I'm gonna do is we're gonna test the me with a caddy and me without a caddy. And the caddy is the Bushnell V4. And so two balls of every hole, we're going to finish it metal score and I'm going to use my old method of studying yardage, which was literally walking to different sprinkler heads, checking on marker posts, counting it out. Uh, it was never accurate and it always gives you indecision. So it's not ideal for when you're trying to actually figure out what golf club you want to be hitting. And so what I think is gonna happen when I add this little tool into my armory is that I'm gonna be more accurate, which means I can be more versatile with my shot selection because I know exactly what I'm gonna be hitting. So it's much easier to club up, club down, and then you're only assessing your context, which is the weather, the lie, the location of the pin. Um, do I need to go over water? Do I need to avoid a piece of uh, land that I don't want to be hitting at and this is stuff that I just don't have I didn't have in the past I can could study it with my eyes But I don't know what the yardage is I need what I need to hit to get to the front of the green to the back of the green And so if it works for the pros it should work for us amateurs too, right? But it's a little bit expensive to hire our own caddy. Let's see how it goes it, It's a it's a open test. I don't know if it's gonna be a, a good thing or a bad thing so I wish Bushnell luck. I hope the product is, is truly the number one rangefinder on tour. And um, let's see what the results are.